We're taking this uh, big fancy machine right here and uh, basically shooting radiation at some fossils to see what's inside of them. Researchers are using CT scans to take a deeper look at dinosaur fossils to help make their work more accurate. And the Thessalosaur skull, we're doing that in order to find the internal, uh, the very, very fine, weak, fragile bones that are inside of the skull. It's also saving them time. In the old days, if we wanted to see what was inside some of these um, fossils, we'd have to very slowly and painstakingly take them completely apart. And um, on an animal that's got 10,000 scales on it, still preserved all in, in place, that's just not something that we really wanted to do with these critters. And for the first time, researchers can see through the thick scales of an alligator garfish and confirm a new species. So it shows us all the internal delicate parts and um, gives us more data and more characters that we can code in here and then um, make our case that, yeah, this is, this is not Actragostia spatula, it's not Tropicus or anything like that. This is its new species. This scan allows them to see what the creature ate and what happened to it after it died. This enables us to collaborate with scientists worldwide, and honestly, we do. Um, we'll, we'll have scientists in, in Europe, in Japan, in Australia that are looking for data on this, and, you know, you just set up a, a internet folder to share it, and there you go. In Colorado Springs, Allison Mastrangelo, Fox 21 News.